Welcome back to Real Life Reviews and in this video we're going to take a look at Hoob's Varman buoyancy shorts. Let's get straight to the point on these buoyancy shorts. The star feature is what Hoob call their plus 43 and they have it emblazoned on the outer thigh of the legs. Their plus 43 new neoprene that they're putting into the buoyancy shorts and also starting to put into their wetsuits as well. Plus 43, Hoover claiming for the equivalent thickness, five millimeters, that you get 43% more buoyancy out of this neoprene. And we've got on test at the moment, the Varman wetsuit, uh, which employs obviously a lot more of that, and there'll be a review of that coming out quite soon. So the big feature about these buoyancy shorts is that for the same thickness of neoprene, we're getting more buoyancy. So how is that employed within these shorts? Well, Hoob, and they did it with their alpha shorts, Hoob employ three millimeter neoprene in the front and the back of their buoyancy shorts and five millimeter in the sides and into the legs. Now, I've done a review of their alpha buoyancy shorts using more normal neoprene, and I've got to admit, I do like having the buoyancy on the outside. Personally, something I, I need to work on and I work on a lot when I'm in a, a much more of a sort of skill development phase, and it's winter in the UK, so now, is what I like to work on is initiating my turn into breathing, for example, with the hips and not the shoulders. So I'm, em I'm employing the core, I'm engaging it, and I'm getting a much smoother, and I'm not getting a twist that I get if I feel the initiation from the shoulder. So I like that. Lots of buoyancy shorts will load the center, and we'll be looking at stability on the swim, potentially, and some buoyancy shorts are much more even all over. So I've got to say, I like having the, the increased buoyancy on the outer thigh and into the leg. So I mentioned leg. The leg length of these is much more what you'd come to expect from a normal core short. Um, here's the blue 70 and if I put them next to each other you'll see that they are very similar in, in length and again if I try to sort of overlap them, put them together and there we have pretty much standard same length of each short. So they're much more normal. When we reviewed the alpha short from Who, and here are the alphas, one of the features of the alphas was that their leg length was much longer. So it went much closer to the knee and you got that lift from lower down as well. Partly that's been sort of superseded by the plus 43 and from feel you definitely do get more buoyancy out of these shorts and you're getting less restriction down to the knee but getting a similar effect lower down the leg where you're getting a bit more lift from the legs. Clearly there are kick pants out there and who do their own version and have their kick pants um, and if you want much more of a leg feel then similar to your wetsuit, you're gonna to head towards a kick pan. But the Varman creates increased buoyancy from a much more standard length on the, on the core shorts. So I mentioned general feel. These, again, I've said it before about hoop kits, they don't feel as chunky as equivalent buoyancy or core shorts that you would get from other manufacturers or many manufacturers. And that, again, is a plus point to me. There is potentially a sense that you need to be more careful because they, they might feel more fragile to some people. But believe me, I've worn hoop kit, amongst other kit, for, for a number of years now. And, and that is a, a comment I've come up with frequently is that whilst it might feel like that, they wear no, no worse and actually sometimes and often better than kit that feels chunkier and more heavy duty. So actually I like the general feel 
being less chunky than some of its competitors. Another element you're going to come across in these shorts is on the outer thigh where we've got this this pattern down here it's it's very it's got a bit of a stiffener in it um, again I quite like it. it it lends to that psychological feel feeling when I, I'm working on hip rotation and initiating from the hips it gives me a sense I can feel it and when I work the hips I just know where I am a bit better I think it's very subjective I agree uh, but I do like the little stiffener that's down the outer thigh at this point I've got to mention one small little feature that that hoop have altered and I really really like I have consistently criticized who in the past and their kick pants and their alpha shorts do this for putting the tie on the shorts on the outside I find this untidy I find this for from a company that that's after that looks for marginal gains and I'm a massive fan of Dan Bigham and the work he does having the tie on the outside small amounts of resistance I don't like it I always tuck it in but it's being tucked over and I've mentioned that in every review I've done and here we are we have the Varman buoyancy shorts with the tie on the inside yes thank you Hoob whether you've listened to me I don't know and quite frankly I, I don't care but you've done something that I really really like thank you there we are Hoob's Varman buoyancy shorts I love them there's a real danger that that one might overuse them and and I have to to push out there talk to your coach talk to whoever's instructing you talk to people around your club whatever but but buoyancy shorts or core shorts are a training tool uh, you might also want to use them in a, in a squad session if you're just feeling a bit lacking in energy you will swim faster with them because they'll, they'll give you that buoyancy lower down and reduce resistance but I really like these buoyancy shorts. I prefer them to Hoob's Alpha. I prefer them to, to other ones I've been using. I picked up the Blue 70 Core. I do like those a lot, but this is my favorite one. And almost to the extent I'm overusing them. I'm, I'm wearing them more than I probably should do. Um, and telling myself my excuse is it's winter training and I'm working on, on skill uh, and technique. Uh, but I really really like these shorts If you've enjoyed the video, please give it a, a thumbs up like and share with your friends If you want to buy a pair of these core shorts, well, there's a link to wiggle in the description down below and You get some great deals there, but not only that Everything you spend the channel gets a small percentage and that helps keep the channel going you pay no more You get the deals. We just get a very small amount of it coming back from wiggle um, if you've not yet subscribed, well, click on the small circle down there. If you want to visit our website, well, that's just down there and there are more affiliates there for you to get some great deals. And if you want to see some other reviews, well, the Hube Alpha shorts are up there and the Hube Kick Pants are up there. Thanks again for watching.